G'day, I'm Ben Dobinson from Dobinson's. Uh, I take care of all the research and development uh, for our suspension and accessories. And I'm just gonna give you guys a quick rundown on our MRA shocks, um, some of the components in them, and uh, some of the materials and stuff we've gone with to really make sure that they're the best shock we can offer. Uh, so we'll just start with the bodies. Um, so the bodies themselves, uh, they're a drawn over mandrel, uh, three mil thick material, um, close to one eighth thickness. So we run a 66 millimeter outside diameter body for the bigger stuff. And uh, for the, the smaller trucks where the space is a little tight, we uh, run a 56 millimeter outside diameter body. So once we get the uh, drawn over mandrel seamless material from the factory, uh, we'll run a honing and machining through these and we'll go down to a tolerance of around uh, 0.04 millimeter, which is about one and a half foul in the old money. So super tight tolerances and that gives us a really nice seal to our piston and wear band. Running these tolerances this tight uh, really allows us to get the damping fine tuned to what we're chasing. Uh, the, the body ends themselves are CNC robotic TIG welded to the tubes, um, that gives us a really nice seal. Uh, and then we run pressure testing as well to make sure that everything is airtight. Uh, we'll then run them through the EDP coating and that gives us a really good uh, surface to protect us against corrosion. So for the reservoirs, uh, we've gone with 6063 aluminum uh, and same again, CNC machined. And then we also get that honed as well to the same tolerance. And again, it's critical to get that tolerance inside nice and tight so that when we've got the floating piston inside there, we can make sure there's a nice seal and we've got the lowest amount of drag and friction that we can get. 